You're like a circle that floats around me, keeping me safe and sound. And when I fall, you've tied a rope to me. You're blessing me every day. I was down with an illusion, like a sparrow with broken wings. But now I shine with your reflection on me. I'm getting back up on my Hey everybody and welcome to another Fitness, Food and Fun Friday. I'm so glad you decided to join me here today because we are in for a lot of fun. My name is Madeline and please like, share, comment, subscribe so we can interact and build a community. So the first thing on the agenda on Friday is the fitness. So I'm going to talk a little bit about my fitness. I'm going to show you a couple of pictures. Um, because I was noticing what, what I did for fitness today, or this week, I'm sorry, what I did for fitness this week was um, my normal Camp Gladiator, and I've talked to you about that before. And I've also did my walking, which, you know, I've probably talked and shown a few clips of that before. But I noticed when I was walking that I would have two apps. I'd have my Garmin watch right here. And then on uh, my phone, I would have the Strava app and I know, and I'd start them both at the same time before I began my walk. And I noticed that the mileage was different. And I've known that for a while because my Garmin is very unreliable. And I'll tell you about that after I tell you this. But um, this morning, I noticed that the time was all, all so different. And um, this is a Garmin, I think it's um, 235, I want to say, or 245. It's an older model Garmin. And I was using it a lot when I was running a lot. And when I hurt myself or became injured, excuse me, when I became injured, then I um, would do the other. So if you put it on here. It says other activity. Oh, let me get it in the shot. It says other activity, if you can see it. And then it would start. It would do the distance and the miles. Oh, it would do this distance and the miles. So uh, I noticed that when I started them today, I was walking. I was checking to see how far I'd gotten. And I noticed that... Um, that the not only was the was the mileage off, the distance off, but also the time was off. My Strava was about two or three minutes faster, and at least a fourth to a third of a mile farther. So what that tells me is that my Garmin is having issues. It might be ready to go to the Garmin graveyard. Um, but I had noticed even when I run was when I was running and I'd run with friends, my distance would always be shorter than theirs. And so, um, you know, it just might be time for me to give get a new running or fitness watch. Um, and I'm thinking about getting the Samsung Watch Four. So if you're out there uh, looking at this, give me a recommendation or a no, skip it. If you would purchase the Samsung for for fitness purposes, because that's going to be that's my main thing. I don't particularly care about text message and people calling me and all this kind of stuff. I can use my phone for that. But my main thing was fitness purposes, whether you think the Samsung for would be a good fitness watch. Uh, and I especially want to do intervals, because as I've talked about before in my um fitness, and I've shown you before, I am trying to uh, do my couch to 5k again. And so I need interval settings. And so my biggest thing is, will it let me do intervals? And I'm with T-Mobile. And the thing about buying it through T-Mobile, if I get it and I don't like it, and it's not what I need for fitness, they charge a restocking fee. And I don't like restocking fees. So every time I go to the store, set on purchasing one, then I remember the restocking fee and I'm like, oh, what if it's not what I want? And in the stores, they only have demos. So please, as my husband tells me, long story short, 
it, uh, let me know if you would recommend the Samsung 4 uh, watch for fitness purposes. So I'm going to give you a couple of shots, screenshots of two walks, one Saturday, one Sunday. And I'm going to put the Garmin readout and the Strava readout side by side so you can see what I'm talking about when I, there's such a big drastic difference in the two. And so I think I didn't, I think I skipped this part, but uh, see, I'm not using notes. That's why I'm all around the bush. But anyway, but I think my Garmin is pausing or losing signal because it's always had plenty of battery. When I walk, I always try to charge it the night before if it needs it. And then um, this morning, you know, it had plenty of charge, but it's just stopping. It's pausing quite a bit without me actually stopping walking or running. So anyway, and now if you can see, it's dark. It, it spent eight hours saving something. Then when I decided to come home, I clicked it and it decided to work. So it just may be that time. I may go online and see if I have any updates or something that I need to do to it. But anyway, so I'm going to show you those shots now. I will stop talking at this point and I will show you those shots. Join you back in a minute for the food. part and you as you can see it's the food i did a little bit of experimenting i'm doing a lot more air fryer cooking lately and wanting to experiment with a lot of new recipes and things so you'll see what i did this weekend for the food here we go <music> Making plantain this morning for breakfast. I used a well, well ripe plantain, coconut oil, tablespoon of coconut oil. And here we go. Well, now it's time for the fun. January 22nd, your girl turned a year older. More seasoned, seasoned with grace. So uh, it was my birthday. I'm going to show you my balloons that my lovely husband got me. And then we're going to take a look at the service that we had on the 23rd. And hopefully I'll be bringing a little bit more fun um, next week. But I hope you enjoy this part. Take a look. <music> purposes and desires been questioned by you first and then by God? Have you made an honest evaluation of where you are and where you want to be in him? 
Now is the time to start asking those questions. I don't want to get in a place where this becomes a ritual that we do every day. I don't want it to become ritualistic, but I want it to become something that empowers me. Well, thank you so much for joining me again on this Fitness, Food, and Fun Friday. And I hope to see you again next week, bringing out the fitness, bringing out the food, and bringing out the fun. Please don't forget to comment about the Samsung. Would you recommend, not recommend? Also share with me your plans for the weekend and what your fitness goals are. And we will see you back here next time. Bye. You're like a circle that floats around me, keeping me safe.